Hey you guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Safia. Make sure you give me a big thumbs up. Go subscribe to my channel right freaking now. I am on the road to 14,000 of you guys. But anyways, today I will be showing you guys how to go from this to this bouncy curls using just a flat iron. Mind you guys, this hair is from smadaextensions.com. It'll be linked down in the description box, 100% luxury version hair. To start off, you're gonna need some hair clips just to separate your hair while working with it and curling it. So I'm gonna start by splitting my hair in half, two sections, and then we are going to break up sections. So as you can see, I'm taking out a medium sized hair and I'm about to turn my flat iron on and wrap the hair around my flat iron while pulling away from my face, guys. Now, we're gonna go through this again because I know it can be a little hard if you've never done this before. However, it's very easy once you get a hang of things. So you're gonna take the flat iron, start at the root and wrap the hair around the flat iron while twirling and pulling away from your face, away from your face, guys. So let's do that again. I'm gonna take out a small section probably like a medium size section you don't have to do it really small but I take out like a medium size and I start at the base wrap that hair around while pulling away from my face and twirling at the same time so as you can see my hand is actually guiding the hair strand so that it doesn't slip or fall off and boom there goes your curl so you're gonna just do that throughout the entire head so I'm actually just gonna let you guys watch until I get to the front of my head because that's when things get a little tricky, well to me in my opinion. So I'm gonna shut up now and let y'all watch until I get to the front of my head. Okay, you guys, so I made it to the front and I'm just sectioning it off and I'm doing the same exact thing, wrapping the hair around and pulling away from my face. Now, the only reason why I say this part is a little tricky is because you want the other side in the front to look kind of similar and it could get a little hard to get the front to look the same. Y'all gonna see what I'm saying, but just make sure you do the same thing in the front and everything should go well now on this side i'm going to continue to curl away from my face now some people do one half away from their face and the other half towards their face but me i just go the same direction the whole time so i am going to curl it and pull out away from my face the entire time and you guys will see and i will come back again once i get to the top Alright guys, so for some reason I decided with this strand to go curl towards my face. As you guys can see, the curl is going towards my face, but it really doesn't matter if you switch it up. It just makes it look that much better. So yeah, I don't know, for some reason I decided to do that 
particular curl towards my face just like this one too so yeah just wanted to let you guys know really doesn't matter which direction you choose just understand that you're going to use the same technique throughout the whole head which is wrapping the curl twirling the curl pulling the curl that's it and that's all <laughs> So now that I'm done with the curling part, it is time to style and fluff out. So basically what I'm going to end up doing is finger combing the curls out. So first I use my Argan Oil of Morocco. This stuff is my holy grail. It basically just keeps the curls nice, sleek, not even curls, hair period. It just keeps it so like nice, okay? And it smells good too. So as you guys can see, I'm just finger combing my hair out. Do not use a comb just use your fingers and finger comb it out and it'll just lay so nice um just play around with it as you can see the curl in the front is different from the other one and i don't know why like i'm so bad at getting that front curl to be the same as the other side like i just can't do it but <laughs> i tried my best and now i'm going in with the flat iron if you do not have a flat iron make sure you go down to smartextensions.com i have blinged out flat irons they're so popping but flat irons are the key to a flat install if you do not have a flat iron honey get you one like for real for real so yeah that's all i'm doing right now <laughs> Now I am going in with my Smata Wax Stick. Coming soon, guys. Coming soon. This basically helps lay the hair and keep it nice and sleek, flat. Like, I cannot have my hair done without using the Smata Wax Stick. This wax stick is life along with the hot comb. Honey! Honey! Like, do you see? So now, this is the Gorilla Glue. I use this Gorilla Snot Glue, whatever, Gorilla Snot, for my baby hairs. Now, I don't like to go crazy with my baby hairs. Um, as y'all can see, I have I use a raggedy old toothbrush for my baby hairs. Um, I like the light and feathery look when it comes to baby hairs. I do not like really thick baby hairs, so um, it takes me a while to get my baby hairs the way I want it so just sit back relax and watch how I do them okay you guys this is the finished look i'm absolutely in love with it i'm absolutely in love with this hair this lace everything it's the everything for me this transparent closure it's a five by five closure this hair is so soft luscious full of body um i've had it for a while now probably over six months and it has not given me any problems um just to let you guys know these curls do not last that long because they are loose but make sure y'all give me a thumbs up subscribe to my channel and until next time bye if you come in for me know you gotta come correct if you don't i'ma check you like we playing chess roll me on my stomach and i let him do the rest damn that shit hurt i could feel it in my chest i thank god for the lessons he done taught me because the love for myself is anointing i wake up every day looking like good morning